We all know that exercise is good for us. Research has shown that specific intensive exercise of these muscles administered in a clinical setting reduce or eliminate chronic pain. These machines were developed by a company called Medex, located in Ocala, Florida. Hello, I'm Pat Summerall. Utilizing its patented technology, Medex is now researching the role of clinical strength training in the treatment of diseases such as osteoporosis which is gradual loss of bone density. The MedX approach is taught at the University of Florida, which has also produced much of the research. One of the thousand or so MedX equipped clinic operators throughout the world is Dr. Ted Dreisinger, who runs progressive spine care and rehabilitation in Columbia, Missouri. What attracted us most to the MedX idea was isometric testing. Uh, testing back patients without moving them. The idea of being able to stabilize a patient and move them through specific ranges of motion while you were testing them seemed to be really safe. In addition to testing isometrically, even during exercise with dynamic repetitions, MedX decreases chance of injury. Its low inertial weight stacks travel as little as an inch and a half on one of its medical neck machines and no more than one foot on any exercise machine, despite the much greater distance of limb movement. This means less acceleration and a reduction in biomechanical impact forces at takeoff and turnarounds. Chances of so-called muscle strain are reduced dramatically. Exercising a painful back is not something therapists are inclined to do. But Dr. Dreisinger has an explanation. It takes movement through discomfort for good nutrition to happen at the cellular level. Pelvic restraint is critical in the effective measurement of spine function. MedX pioneered the standard of restricting pelvic rotation so that the measured torque output is that generated strictly by the spinal muscles without interference from the buttocks and hips. While muscle supports the spine, like cable supporting a suspension bridge, Dr. Dreisinger says there's another benefit to spinal fitness. One of the great values of the MedEx exercise is that while you're in the machine, isolated and moving back and forth, there's really a pumping action, moving fluid in and out of the disc, hydrating it, increasing the nutrition to it, and all the things necessary to make it function better. MedEx is a company founded by the same man who had earlier invented Nautilus equipment, Arthur Jones. In developing MedEx, Jones forged ties to the University of Florida through the late Dr. Michael Pollack. Pollack was the head of the American College of Sports Medicine and spearheaded much of the research. Seeing what MedEx could do in treating back and neck pain, Another University of Florida professor wondered what it could do to restore bone loss. Organ transplant patients, due in part to their medication, can lose 10 to 20 percent of spine and pelvic bone. So almost out of desperation, we tried the MedEx line of resistance training equipment. And we were able to put bone on people and return their bone mineral density back to pre-transplant levels. Doctors are also looking to apply the exercise routine to not only osteoporosis, but also diabetes, obesity, and other maladies that creep upon us as we age. Dr. Braith thinks they have a good idea. I think that physical therapists or physical therapy assistants or people without those types of clinical degrees could take this very simple paradigm that we've developed here at the University of Florida and administer it to all patient populations at very, very low risk. The great benefit that Medix brings to the table is the ability to measure and show change and document that change clinically. We would like to use the Medix line of equipment to study neuromuscular diseases and the arthritic populations. There isn't much that we see clinically that we can't treat uh, with musculoskeletal strengthening. It's a marvelous tool that can be used in almost every kind of uh, clinical rehabilitation setting. MedEx can also have a positive impact on the bottom line. In the airline industry, we were able to reduce costs for 
back injury both on the private side and the workers comp side significantly by strengthening people prior to them having a clinical event. The MedEx difference is the quality, durability, and effectiveness of the machines it produces. We've also shown that reutilization of the healthcare system, which probably is the key to success in rehabilitation. We often talk about returning to work as a key issue, but we think that returning to work is good, but not using the healthcare system is better. Since MedEx was founded in 1988, doctors have been amazed at the positive effects of proper muscle strengthening on a range of ailments, including lower back pain. MedEx creates machines that safely and effectively pinpoint trouble areas, measure the effects of gradual exercise, and help repair the damage. MedEx continues to lead the way in rehabilitation medicine with its breakthrough technology.